Oh, yeah, that's better. Yeah, I know I am. And by the way, folks, yes, you have tuned into the right time. This is the DGB by the talk. Way, who are you called fat? I was looking at that photo that you hung up on the wall. I that am, big poster. I'm not fat, you know what? I'm a plump. I'll accept plump, but I won't accept fat. I know, folks. It's, it's one of them nights. And by Get on with it. I, I am. It's starting to sound like my ex. She always used to say, get on with it, no matter what we are doing. She told me. No, I don't believe a word she says. Get on with it, will you? Introduce the show. This is the DGB talk. You've got the Aussie oh, Dead Man Toad here. It's hard to get good help where it is. And as you can hear, that's your little favourite, the roadie snake. You have to do everything. You don't have to do everybody think really, do I? You, you, you have been talking to my ex, haven't you? No, we talked with Uncle Festus, actually. Oh, don't believe what he says. Right, you finished? <laughs> You're definitely <laughs> sounding like my ex. <laughs> oh. Anyway, yeah, that. that being said, what have we got tonight? Oh. Besides a headache. And an idiot. Why, Uncle Festus in here, is he? No, but whatever there was in that bag last week, it's, it's moved. Well, it definitely ain't uh, Dr. Bill, because he's still overseas. Oh. I don't know what it was, but it went off in you know, a hurry. Had a hell of a scream to it, too. Oh, I know who that was, then. Anyway, we have Ray Stevens. Oh, yeah? Now, most of you who are old enough to remember, you will remember he did the, the thing in the street. Uh, he was born in 1939 on January the 24th. He is now 85 years old and married to Penny Jackson. Uh, two children, Susie Rags, Ragsdale and Timmy Jones. And for some of you out there, you will remember this man. He also was the Sing, he also sang the theme song to both Cannonball Run movies. He's done a lot of uh, songs for movies, actually. He also sang a Arab the a a a Arab. Ahab the Arab. Yeah. Everything is beautiful. You're misty. Um, he's been around since the I'm 60s. My, I like that song of his, On My Own Grandpa. Yes. And you, most of you who remember, who can remember as far back as it was old enough as us will remember Along Came Jones. And the video clip of that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that little and kid. Your, one of your favourites, Dudley Do Right. Oh, Dudley Do Right of the. Um, yeah, that's a good song, that. Yes. Uh, he's, he does a lot of things. Uh, too Drunk to Fish, I've been there, done that. Um, <laughs> oh, oh, I don't because I'm a good little Catholic boy. Uh, the Mississippi Squirrel. That's a, that's a funny one. Um, as I said, he was born Harold Ray Ragsdale, professionally known as Ray Stevens, American country and pop singer, sing, singer songwriter, and comedian. Also, he's best known for his grammar winning recordings of Everything is Beautiful and Misty, as I said before, and as well as novelty hits such as Guitars Anne and The Streak, which we brought up before. Born in Clarkdale, Georgia. Oh, God. So, uh,. His parents were Willis Harold Ragsdale and Francis Stevens Rank Ragsdale. His big, like I said, his first biggest hit was Everything Is Beautiful, back in 1970. It won a Grammy Award. Was the theme song for his summer TV show in 1970. Uh, number one hit for both pop and adult contemporary charts and marked his first time in the top 40 on the country charts peaking at number 39. A lot of people sang that song after he did. Yeah, well if you hear it and uh, you'll, you'll know who it is. As I said, uh, tonight we have, uh, in honor of that, Along Came Jones. Good. Thank you. Uh, we have the Cannonball Run opening. Uh, but before that one, we have Mr. Custer from 1969. Yes, he was the singer of that song of Mr. Custer. And I've also got in uh, my files down here in the shed, 
the follow-up to uh, Mr. Custer. Yes. So, uh, those are the ones we've got tonight. Is it? If you can, if you, you'll find him on YouTube, folks, and other places like Spotify, all those sort of things. Where, wherever you get your Apple Music, wherever you find it. And if you want to laugh, it's the. He's he stuff he does. It's really hilarious. Oh yes. Uh, I, I do encourage you to check out the Along Came Jones. There's also one where he does a duet with a fellow on a TV show back in the day. And there's one little kid comes dressed up with a little cowboy outfit on. It's just hysterical. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> you get to see it, folks. It's, uh, it's he, That version minutes. where that kid comes out in the cowboy outfit, yeah. it, it'll crack you up. Oh, yeah. I mean, if you've got a sense of humour, you're going to love it. Uh, he, he also brought out one that I love is uh, since Bubba changed his name. You've, if you see that, and you you know, you, with there's all this weirdness that's happening in the world these days, that's his parody on things. He also did one uh, not so long back, a few years ago, about uh, wearing a mask. So they're oh, all yeah. out there. They're all out there, folks. Find them yourself. You know. Yeah, I mean, some of them. I mean, I. I am yet to find one of his songs, Snake, where he does swear. I have never yeah, found he, one. I've never found one myself. He, he's uh, a very... Uh, very polite and clean so yes. songs. There's that one you were talking about, the 1987, I'm My Own Grandpa. Oh, that's... The cracking the, Up album. Oh, yeah. And also, there's one in, uh, he did in, 70, in the, from the Spirit of 76 album in 2011 called Grandpa Voted Democrat. <laughs> <laughs> hey. So, like I said, he's got, there's a lot, a lot of songs out there, folks, of uh, Ray Stevens. So, uh, just type that in if you want a bit of a laugh. There you go. Yes, definitely, folks. Highly recommend that guy. Oh, yeah. All right, that being said, let's get on with it. Yeah, I think I should go down into the vault and find these songs and play them. Yes, I definitely will agree. Catch you next week. Here we go, folks. Let's see what happens.